didn't you you he guys uh, you, you guys you guys didn't give me a chance to make him creepy so you know i know no, we, no, kinda, we kind of have to bring him that. back now nah, saris was like hey fuck all this i'm gonna come up with a good plan. Hey. i'm gonna I'm come gonna up my with own a party. plan <laughs> i'm gonna make a plan wait no don't do that <laughs> Wait, no, stop. No, stop. <laughs> um... Oh, yeah, um, I think we can finish campfire right quick, Alex. I suppose. Um... Yeah. No, you can't. You won't be okay. able to. We didn't do our homework in time, I'm sorry. I had nightmares about doing homework. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> That's rough, buddy. Yeah, I, I feel for you. Uh, I actually had nightmares doing my homework tonight. <laughs> yeah, so, um... Why didn't they... Where are they? Huh? I imported some creatures. Yeah. And they're not where I... Not where I... Not where I thought they'd be. Classic Chris non secretary Um... <laughs> yeah, so, uh... Gonna talk about that's one. So uh, oh can... oh wow, Chris. I'm sorry. Yeah, go for it. Uh, the, I, I'm gonna mute myself. Go for Please. it. Do what you gotta do. Wait, 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 wait. Recap first, then you can finish. Okay. Oh, I'm not dead. Ooh. Prim fucking Ooh. hates the Raven Queen with a goddamn passion. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> That's gonna make Sarah's you look like sister is named something and she's asleep. Ooh. <laughs> oh yeah. Corona. <laughs> yes, that's the one I was looking for. She went for. back to sleep. Yeah. She's no longer so gravy. Gravy. Saving grave point. Woo. Graving grave point. Mm -hmm. My brain got ahead of myself. No, she is now graving graves point because that's where they're all gonna be. Although she's asleep. Yeah. yeah, she flew back and fell asleep, right? Yeah. Yeah. She's here. She's here she's and fell asleep. What cat? What the fuck? So grave point right now is currently unguarded. Yeah. I'm gonna fight. But still in the air. But still so in the air. So hopefully. Maybe that'll help. Fingers crossed. Something. I have a question. Is it like moving in the air or is no. it stationary? It's stationary. From what we know, okay. it's stationary. Okay. From limited knowledge, it's stationary. It'll be moving once we try to yeet. Wait, we're gonna try and yeet it now? Yeah. Why? Fuck it, I don't know. That's what happens when you let the fighter come up with a plan. Uh, yeah. <laughs> to be fair, it's better than when you let the bard come up with a plan, which is seduce. Seduce the rock. <laughs> We've already seen how well your seduction works. <laughs> uh, brilliantly, thank you. Turns him into <laughs> Sorry, guys. I'm actually kind of in a funk right now. That's all right. I don't. I haven't. I haven't seen any change from you, so it's, it's you're, you're fine. I'm not at Alicia's throat. That's the change. Are you normally at my throat? <laughs> no. But you need to step up to her level. <laughs> you're uh, you're lacking there. All right, so yes, uh, Verona, Verona, Verona just decided to drop out of the sky, look for her brother, see her brother fall asleep. Yeah, fuck you, Saris. You were only dead for five years. Oh, dead to her. How, how do you know? Mm, I was assuming. You just think that's true. I mean, um... she has, at the very least. She has not seen you in five years. 
Christ, what if we were in the fucking shadow fell for like ten more? <laughs> ten know, maybe more all the years. Would have worked uh, out by then. <laughs> all right, so campfire. All right, so I'm sorry, my cat is chosen right now to stand in front of that monitor. Nice. The ideal location for all cats. Mm-hmm. I'm not. I'm not kidding. She's bunting my monitor. Um. Get in the lap. Come on. I can't read that. Move. I don't. Okay. Just being silly. Yeah. So, um, to uh. So our last experience with Duskwalker, for um, context, that was the sword he was hitting us with, right? Yes, that was me trying to... Okay. Fuck off, cat. Oh my god. She's doing it again. Okay, here. They're going on the floor. Or not. Okay. You stared her. Sorry. Um... Well, um, she's really distracting. Pick her up then? and put her on your lap. She is on my lap. Now she's like bunting my arm. And pet her and continue. Love her. Be better. Sorry, I'm right. easily distracted and this cat is being a cat. Oh, um, well, it was obvious that you didn't want to hurt us. Um, but how does a sword lose its way? I don't know, but it's uh, intelligent. And grumpy. 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 All right. Um. Well, if you need help making it find its way, um, I'm here. I'm he sure nods. the others would too. Yeah, I'm not sure how our conversation is going to go yet. With the sword? With the sword. Yes. Um, you have my support. Are this you is like really the sword awkward? Currently, are you are you holding? I, the sword? I am currently, yeah. Okay. It's probably not like out menacing me, but no, just like showing, showing the sword. It's gonna go back up now. Yeah, it's probably asking for bagels or something. It, it wants bagels. We awkwardly nod at each other and give the thumbs up. <laughs> I thought I thought you were gonna say something. Um, yeah, I guess uh, we uh, return to walking back. Uh, did you get that message? I did. He doesn't stop. <laughs> okay. Now, you see, what I'm trying to do as a player is get Leo to tell Cyrus that he's going to become a Death Knight. What? Does Leo know he's going to become a Death Knight if he fails? Yeah, he knows that. Mm-hmm. It's just if he fails, he's fine. <laughs> it's only if he fails. He will succeed. <laughs> I mean, I'll be honest, if we fail, then... Leo becoming a Death Knight is kind of the word. That's kind of the least of our worries. Yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, no, it's just specifically the sword. Me and the swords conversation. If I fail but, at that, then I Death Knight. But I know, I know that if if Sarah's knew, she would do something specific. Okay. No problem. 
think so. Yeah. All right. So, um, Rose carrying Verona and Blue at the same time. Nice. Nice. Uh, mm -hmm. <laughs> wearing blue is kind of like a backpack thing and Verona is being princess carried. Oh, that's so not sexy. Can we switch? You're not the one unconscious. Yeah, I was just about to say. I could be. If it means I get carried that way. I will Don't carry you. Unconscious. We're dragging you by your feet. I will carry you later. This is more important right now, Blue. Fine. Hurt. And, uh, yeah, the Shatterkai look at all of you in kind of confused horror. Like, they're not exactly scared of you, but it's they're not exactly not scared of you. Yeah. You guys just basically walked up to an ancient dragon and told it to shut the fuck up. I was also and dragon at a point. Yeah, that, yeah, that's, that's the thing. It listened. <laughs> yeah. Um, I think Brent's gonna have to stay behind and handle a few things before catching up again. It's fine. Brent's I will stay my prim. Because uh, Shadow Walker was there, right? Yes. Yeah, she'll go up to him and be like, oh, yeah, I'm sorry, I probably should have warned you about this. But about can... the dragon. E yeah. Um, oh no, that's that, that's no trouble at all. It's more. It was it, it, really it, late when I found out that she was on her way, and I didn't realize that she would be approaching in her form. I thought she maybe would have, you know, changed back before approaching a village that is kind of hostile. Oh, I'm sure it was no problem at all. You know, just a giant blue dragon heading to our village. I'm sure there was, there's no need for, I'm, I apologize. I'm just upset right now. I'm sorry. She probably felt her brother coming back to life, her twin brother, and had to get here as fast as she could. So I understand. It is understandable. It does not mean I, that I'm that it does not cause for alarm, but it is understandable. Wait, I thought it was Jari and Rose who were the twins. No, no, Verona no, and Rose are the twins. Okay, because Rose was supposed to be the king. Jariana is the middle child. Yep. Uh, see that I did not. I did not know that. <laughs> Yeah, Cyrus is the younger sister. And then there's Wrath Baby. Yeah, there's Wrath Baby that we Wrath don't know much about right now. For uh, so you all do 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 you do you keep them for anything? Ask any more questions of him because mm -hmm. he's gonna start getting his people nope. seeing get, attending to injuries. Yep, sorry. Yes. Uh. Uh. -huh. uh oh the God. the injuries are actually in incredibly light on their half mm -hmm. they 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 don't most of it's superficial uh someone was just kind of tossed into a tree but it, it didn't break anything they're they're more bruised mm -hmm. he was front. just thrown into a tree it's fine the tree is actually totally <laughs> right, fine. yeah the tree's more important i mean you just rub some fucking salt on that i mean i mean I, I, I mean, he was literally thrown, not like, not like, he, he was tossed up into it. Yeah, oh, so he didn't just, like, slam into the truck. Yeah, of... no, 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 he, he, he was thrown into the tree. Oh, here, Academy. <laughs> like, she was basically trying to get people out of her way. And, um... Yeah, it's mostly superficial wounds. A uh, couple, maybe 15 minutes later, you all arrive back at the uh, village itself, village proper itself, and uh, you see the uh, high priestess sitting kind of 
awkwardly, you know, what with her horribly mangled body. Uh, horribly mangled body. Uh sitting is sitting in a chair outside waiting. And uh the Shatter Kai walk up to her and kinda kneel down before her. And uh she looks to all of you, so how did it go? And Rose uh, Rose did not uh Rose went to the uh little side cottage that was provided for all of you. Mm. Well, um, my it was my sister. All is fine, though. Did, did we catch up, or are we still behind? Uh, you're only behind by, like, you were only behind by, like, a minute. Okay. It, it, you catch up, it's fine. We waited. And, uh, she looks to all of you. I think she, your sister is probably going to need some rest. And the Shadow Walker looks over to all of you. Take all the time that you need. And High Priestess will, uh, will say, this was in the prophecy. I should have told you, brother. I apologize. And he's like, and he says, okay, does everybody not, does anybody want to tell me, anybody else want to tell me about the dragon? It was anybody? really, really early in the morning, and I didn't want to wake you up. Anybody? Anybody else? Anybody? Who else knew about the dragon? Only I did. Oh, one other person. Good. Excellent. She doesn't sleep, though. Her sister. <laughs> That's why she knew. I. You understand that I was put in charge of this of this village, and you have done an excellent job and assessed the situation perfectly. Thank you. You did what you had to do. Now, as for the matter of payment. Looks to all of you. I am going to need one of your how to put it human cuisines. You want a meal? I have not been out of the Shadowfell for that long. And most of the food that has crossed my path has been of this kind of elven it's been green it's been green and I hate it so you want meats I would like a meal please and she smiles All right, well, I guess we gotta go hunting. Do any of you guys know how to cook? Rim, I'm sure Leo can Rim probably does. grill meat. Her mother was a mom. She probably knows how to cook. Oh, oh yes. Of course she does. Yeah. Ferris does not. Um, I can do the hunt part, but cooking it? Don't ask me. I... Just eat fantasy ramen. That's it. That's all I eat. <laughs> That's the brand. Ramen. Fantasy. Mm. <laughs> yes. But yet you maintain that figure. Exactly. That's metabolism. Okay, so... I guess I'll go hunting. Yes. Go do that thing. I'll come with you. Sure. Yes, go do that thing. Okay. okay. Blue, some... could you could you attend me for a few moments? Uh, sure. You you should put some ointment on that, and I'm like pointing all over the. <laughs> 
just at her. Yep. It could be worse. It could be worse. I feel Wait, obligated kinda... to hit Evan in the back of the Wait, are you talking about the- I thought you were talking to Blue, you're talking to the poor woman? Mm -hmm. Yep. <laughs> kinda... Kinda... Well, he was lift an eyebrow. You're talking about the injuries I took saving your friend. I'm still mad that you didn't tell us he wasn't coming back. That's quite enough for that. I'm gonna go uh, get food. I see. Well, I apologize that I did not inform you of everything. That is that is a failing upon my part and upon me as a high priestess of the Ra Raven Queen. I will be sure to better myself for the future. I think she told you to fuck off, dude. Yeah, but she did it the she did it in the nice way, so now I feel guilty. Yeah, she did she took Fucking that high road. Sure. <laughs> I only felt kind of guilty. Now I feel actually guilty. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. You feel guilty just, for being an asshole. Just, just go get... It was the first time for everything. Yeah, I'm, I'm just going because, you know, I... <laughs> Shadow Walker. Could you do me a favor and lead, um... Our illustrious death, uh, death speaker to the kitchens? I think she would like to prepare herself for the meal that to come. And I give a cautious sigh between Blue and the High Priestess and follow the Shadow Walker. You see the Shadow Walker doing this kind of grumbling. Fuck it, like I don't know. You can go to the kitchen. You can tell me what to do, stupid sister. I'm an adult. <laughs> Not my mom. Remember, he's notably human. Mm -hmm. Um. So we'll start with uh, blue. Yay. Um. She asked. She asked you to come to her side. Uh, uh, blue, blue will stand by her. You are an interesting creature. I've heard. I have a question for you. Yes, I am single. Beautiful. <laughs> I'm sorry, but my mate died a long time ago. Now, uh, yeah. oh, go ahead. Nope, I was not going to say anything, and I'm glad you continued. Go. Okay. Now, now. As for you, do you know your parents? Nope. Are you interested in knowing? I mean, yeah, I mean, everyone, you know, should be interested in knowing where they came from. Excellent. Then I shall tell you a story story yeah. <laughs> I was about to say that <laughs> once upon a time there was a woman and man adventurers both one a paladin of supreme skill the other a healer of infinite wisdom The paladin sought not power or prestige, but the ability to carry out the divine the divine judgment that his god required of him. 
The healer followed along without even thought. She did all he asked, and he did everything he could to bring about an era of peace. Now, the interesting about this paladin is not what he is or what he became. It is what he did to save the love of his life. He thought himself the, su the supreme in martial skill. And then the man named Zeldaris came to him. A wizard of well the weave to him is but a tapestry for him to use to his all powerful will and he captured the love of his life the healer For many years, the paladin roamed the land, searching for his lost love. He felled wizard after evil wizard after evil wizard, ancient rulers, liches all abound, and he only grew in power and strength. Until one day, he just knew that he would always win. And then Zeldaris returned to him. And thus the first sin was born. Pride. Manipulating... Oh, <laughs> ah, you have seen him then. Yeah. 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 Like for a sec. I mean he was I pretty hot. Oh god damn it, Blue. <laughs> Every time. Good. Excellent. <laughs> then you know the creature that I speak of. Pride had a simple experiment after years of waiting and turning turning Zeldaris turning Z or Zeldaris turning him into this creature of ultimate passion he made a dragon. A dragon so powerful that it defied logic and reason. But it was bound by pride's own will. The love of his life thought that it was unhealthy for his relationship with her because he became obsessed with understanding this creature and making it grow to this godlike status and struck the creature down. Unfortunately, such a creature cannot be properly killed. Gods are, well, gods. And so, I believe your dragon friend, not the one that belongs to her, as he points over to, or she points over to Sarah's, who I assume was st sticking around. Yeah, yeah, I'm still there. Yeah, uh, but. The smaller one. 
I've seen Story since we came back, right? Yes. Okay. Is Story with me right now? Remember, yes. She's she's invisible sitting on your head. But uh, remember, she puked up the souls and helped yeah, with the ritual. Yeah, yes, because then I killed all them. <laughs> Classic. Oh, blue. Listen. I don't want to think about how bad Blue's death count just got from that. <laughs> uh, Blue. I mean, you didn't kill anybody. Body. You didn't kill anybody. They were Thank you. Dead. There we go. Yeah. You're they okay. got out of existence. They got cleaned out of existence. Uh, now, Blue's <laughs> even more clean. Uh, you cleaned their clocks. Uh, Sorry, continue. Now, unfortunately... I cannot say who your parents really are, because if I am not mistaken, Story created you. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> no, it's, it's the other like way. Dropping something. <laughs> uh, I'm made her or I guess called her up or something I don't know no I existed before then did you yeah did your guardian ever tell you how you came to be uh I was, okay, this is going to sound cheesy. I was literally abandoned at a circus. You were abandoned as so, a child. Uh, baby, yeah, infant. The small. <laughs> you were abandoned as a baby. I see. Yeah, and the guy who did it, like, died. Yeah, it's really dramatic. I see. Well, you are free to believe as you wish to believe. I am just here to inform you of the events that I have seen. Story and you are one and the same, but different. If I were to put a proper word behind it, it would more be akin to an avatar. Uh, Blue looks just like no registration. She does not understand anything. Blink, 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 yep. blink. <laughs> ah, yes, an avatar. That is good. You do with the information as you will. Looks so she looks over at Saris. I think you might have a better understanding of what I've told her. Um, right. She just called Blue dumb. <laughs> uh, I will say that Blue probably doesn't remember the name of the wizard. Just gonna say that right off the bat. <laughs> Yeah, she doesn't. Um, she's like, I think I've heard that name before. <laughs> yes, that is the wizard that took us in. Yeah. I, I'm afraid I, I don't understand. Your friend here was created by a god so that she could exist outside of herself. Not many knew of, well, I don't think anyone knew of the dragon's existence. And therefore, when a god has no one to worship, they lose their power. <clears throat> it took quite some time for, uh, for the small creature to manifest. But since more and more of you and as... 
Blue has been spreading her stories far and wide, people begin to believe. And with belief comes creation. So wait, if I'm made... Okay, if, if what you're saying is true, if I'm made by story and stories made by pride, does that make pride my grandfather? I suppose, yes. Is it truly so odd? Yeah. Well, like, he doesn't fit my aesthetic at all. Well, his wife is lust. <laughs> no, but like, he doesn't fit my aesthetic. You're not here. We're hunting. Yeah, go. No, I'm... Voice of Evan, leave. <laughs> Jesus. Like, Sorry, you can't be my grandpa. You don't fit my aesthetic. <laughs> your aesthetic? What is yeah. your aesthetic, then? Like, she just gestures to herself. Like, stars? Space? Any of that? Duh. Ah. You don't. And, <laughs> and, and, what of, what of your, uh, Sin. Uh, well, uh, that might be pride, according to some people. <laughs> according to some people. Would you happen to be some of these people? According to a version of myself, yes. <laughs> I see. And this version of yourself you talk to often? She looks at, she looks almost concerned. What, that I talk to her often? Or that she talked too much because I don't think she talked to no, 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 no. You, it, no. She's asked. She looks concerned as you're talking about talking to yourself. Oh. <laughs> no, no. It was. Like, it was a thing. Uh, I, I don't. She. She looks just very. She doesn't want to believe this because it's not the story she's been telling herself. Mm -hmm. She kind of like looks to Saris like, "What do I do?" Well, um. She's not mistaken. Uh, it was a manifestation of her sin. And this manifestation was not? Like, did you defeat this manifestation, or? We did. Not exactly. It looked to blue like... <laughs> like <Wait>. what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Nani the fuck? <laughs> I never overcame my sin. I see. And instead you decided to embrace <laughs> So the the version of yourself <laughs> that told you that you your your sin is pride. Of course I know him. It's me. You <laughs> you You can shut up up there. It. <laughs> you embraced it. Yet that yet pride not might not be your sin. Evidence points that it could is fine, but that doesn't mean like like a Saris isn't you know her grandfather is an a, a, a what you cut out like Saris is 
grandfather is an envy. This is true. No, however, this, like however, the circumstances <laughs> around your creation is different than m most. Does that make her a chosen? Make me a what? A chosen. Of a god. Like my brother. <sighs> I mean, that would be, that would make the whole situation a lot cooler. Am I a chosen? In reality, the sins are considered forces and therefore gods. So, in a sense, yes. Well, technically, yes, but no. <laughs> All right. So, the pros of this is <laughs> she's like, she's kind of figuring out what the pros and cons to this story is. <laughs> God. Like, let's see, I get to be chosen. Uh, it does give me a hot grandfather. Uh, it's kind of a cool story for the general backstory. I don't know. It just, it's weird. Um, Think of it. Blue, you are created from nothing. You are a literal hero brought down from the heavens. <laughs> She looked like that immediately. Just she's like, oh. face ears perk up. <laughs> yeah, like her, you know. She's like, oh, I guess that would be true. What do you Double think, Saris? <laughs> What'd you say? Because an ego boost is what she needs. She did embrace her pride. I'm not the one to put down the better parts of some people. She is, and you all are, heroes after all. If that's what you choose to believe, Blue, I'm free to do so. Uh story? Does any of this ring a bell to you? Story! Ah. Insightful. Ah, I see. <laughs> uh, I mean, I'll have to think about it. Again, do with the information as you will. But I did wish you to know, I don't know if it will come into play upon meeting Pride next, but if there was ever a weakness within that creature, it is this. Once obsessed with something, nothing in the world can distract it. Oh my fucking god! What'd the cat do? He leapt at me! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Alright, so there's something that can distract it, apparently. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Listen, Listen, that was very cats. distracting! Cats are very cats distracting. Kill you. It's fine. There's been three Our cats, cats from three different to... people that have interrupted the session today. Sorry. <laughs> Mine was one of them. Sorry. I, I did hear what you were saying. And let us talk about, well, your grandmother. Would Lust. That... Oh, okay. Did have some part in, in the creation of this creature, after all. Uh... She will do anything for pride. Hmm. 
but know that lust is a very, very not envious. She is more than willing to share, but she does not like to be ignored. So, while it is a weakness for one, it is incredibly dangerous for the other. That is all. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, was look between her and Saris, and uh, she's. Sorry, one second. Cat. Dog. Cat dog. Both my cats left. The other one scared the shit out of the one, so that one left. She's been sleeping on my phone for like three hours. And the other one fucking pounced on her. Cupcake, if you're fucking with the guinea pig again. <laughs> Okay, good. Is that like your permanent pet now, or are you just looking after the guinea pig? I'm looking after the guinea pig until my sister moves back in. Okay. So, yeah. So yes to both. Yes. It doesn't like me yet. Sorry, Alex hurt himself and he's bleeding. Oh, <laughs> what the fuck you do? Jesus. Uh, that's for him to answer. Did he stick his finger in the root beer bottle? <laughs> I wish. Was it that? Is it? Is it? Is it just as dumb? <laughs> I bet he was playing with a knife. That is up for him because he did not tell me. I just make sure he wasn't dying. Uh, but blue will. Is he he's laughing? laughing. He's laughing, so he did some dumb. Is he laughing? Bitch, the fuck you do? <laughs> he probably can hear my responses or your guys's. The fuck you do? Um. Yeah, I think Saris is... Or not Saris. I'm not Saris. Hi. Uh, Blue's gonna look to Saris and be like, I'm gonna go think for a little bit. Alright. Um, let me know if you need anything. Yeah, I'll, I'll catch up with you in, in a while. And she's going to go back to the tent they were staying at. Right. Uh, she leaves. I looked to... Are you certain it was a good idea to tell her that? <laughs> I would rather her be told from someone that was kind about it. And be told that it is okay for her to not have that sort of familial bond rather than her to run into pride and demand that she come to his side. But she wouldn't do that. She just looks at you silently. What did you say, Noah? She, she wouldn't come to Pride Side. Ah. You don't know her like I do. You know that Pride created her. No. Well, now that. Now I do, yes. But that doesn't change who she is. They may have changed what she is. This is true. I don't think you're giving her enough credit. No. I think I'm giving all of you all the credit you need.
What is that supposed to be? Nothing. I honestly find you all fascinating. You have done something that has not been done in several hundreds of years. You have... Fucked up this badly. Overcome and mastered your own virtue or sin. That is not something many can say. That doesn't, choice. that doesn't change that I worry. I have seen things and seen people do things that may or may not break them in the end. She's going to have to no, I will not say. That is not for me to say. Huh. Well, now you've piqued my curiosity. Your friend is going through a difficult change in her life. I think she will come out of it for the better. But it is change, and change is sometimes painful. Yes. I can understand that. Now, I need a bit of assistance. What Could you, you help me to my room? Of course. All right, cool. All right, uh, Leo, Evan, are you guys going separately or together? I don't know. Mm -hmm. Together, it's a date. Hunting date. That would be gay. Yeah, whatever. Also, fucking, what'd she do? Don't worry about it. <laughs> yeah, it was just as dumb as me putting a That's thing. That's the voice thing. of shame. <laughs> I, cut, I almost cut my pinky off with a, a knife once, so... You weren't playing with the, uh... The one pocket knife <laughs> handy oh, thing we no. just found. Okay. Oh, that one? No, that would be significantly less dangerous than playing without... The fuck were you using, then? Again, he, he's, he, he did something super stupid. This is all sounding accurate. So, we're going hunting. <laughs> Are you guys going together or no? Yeah, why not? All right. Who's gonna track the beast? Cause, I will. Cause, cause you're not good. You're not that good at it. You're pretty good at it, but not that good at it. Not ranger good at it. Yeah. Seventeen. So uh. Uh, Leo, okay. So, Leo, are you going to assist or are you going to track by yourself? I should... I will assist, if I can assist. I have a level of... Alright, so then... Evan, give me one more. Alright, yeah, cool. That's about right. Um, so... The Forest of Bear's Glade has several creatures out there. Several, uh, uh, monsters to hunt down. Let me go find an appropriate one for you guys to try to att I know. I love these. Us. I know what it is. It's gonna kill us. I know and they never what it came is. back. Yep. Uh, 
How could you possibly hurt yourself with one of those? Did you, did you stab yourself? Fucking idiot. Oh, he didn't stab himself. No, he just I was a twirling. punch dagger. Oh, yes, you were twirling it. So you, so you just cut yourself. Hey, I'm Alex, fine. That's not a fucking fidget spinner. <laughs> Where'd you cut yourself, buddy? I'm fine. This no, is my that arm. didn't that didn't answer the question. Oh, this is arm. my arm. Oh, your arm. You were spinning it. Did it come off your finger? No. That could have yeah, gone in so. your fucking eye. That's I wear glasses. Glasses yeah, are not glasses protective. Glasses will protect you from. Yeah, sure. I mean, hey, they say that, I but I've deflected. Buy a fidget glasses. spinner or a fidget box. He has so fucking many. Go get one. No. Do it. <laughs> Made worse by the fact that you already have. I have a question. I have a question. Are you still playing with it? No. Go okay. get That's a, yes. a fidget spinner. Okay. okay. I Sounds will find now. your house. And use downstairs. that to murder you. Alicia, confiscate this knife. <laughs> it's downstairs. Cut. I gave it to her. Alicia, yeah, it's our turn. For, I, it's our turn for doing stuff. Go take it. Jeez. No, I heard he took. I heard he got it from him. Good. Thank you. All right. All right. So, Fuck. so, uh, Evan, 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 Evan. How Chris, Chris, would Chris, you Chris. go about hunting? A beast that is that is flying. Because hmm. you have found a couple of feathers of a rather large beast. Okay. Well, first I would stop looking for it on the ground. That's oh my that's god, no one. way. That's a solid start. Then I would try and track its flight path. Just going, gauging by the feathers and the droppings, etc. Um, and then maybe see if I can climb a tree, see if I can find any nesting, like nest remnants. That that I, Jake doesn't really actually know anything about hunting, so okay. All right, so you go about putting your putting putting look for feather feather tracks, looking for excrement, uh, and uh, it eventually leads you down a rather destroyed trail, and uh, you end up at a hillside that's covered in trees, and in this hillside is a Big, big cave. You peer inside along with Leo, and I need you to roll a nature check. Okay. Both of you can if you like, but need nature check. Leo? Would you like to? Oh, okay. <laughs> it's a really big fucking bird. Excellent and it... meal. And it's just sitting there sleeping. Did we all of a sudden I find need... a rock? Yes. I need you both to ro to roll a stealth check. You found a fucking rock, and it's going to kill you. Well, I have good news and I have bad news. Cupcake, I swear to fucking God. Leave the guinea pig alone. Okay. Go to bad. bed. The bad news is Cupcake wants the guinea pig. She wants to eat it. Yep. She wants to play with it. She doesn't want to eat she it. She wants to eat it. She's not a cat. No! Bed! No, sit down. Good dog. No, uh, uh. 
That said good too soon. All right. So, um, Evan. Yeah. You see it and you're like, oh fuck. And and kind of like pull your head back. And Leo, you're like looking at it and you're just like, what the hell is that? What? What is it? It looks like a big bird, but like birds aren't supposed to get that big. And then its oh, eyes open. Your head back. And then its eye opens. Oh. You have encountered what you would call a rock. Uh huh. Now, you're not sure how how bad it, how, how how easily you could take such a creature. But it looks at you and then cause this horrible roar. All right, I'm closing the door so you can't touch the guinea pig. There. It's it, it bed. Bed. There you go. The guinea pig cage is open? No. I would close my door oh. to my room. The guinea pig is in a different room. And she keeps going over there. And the guinea pig freaks the fuck out because it's like, oh, fuck! Big pig! By the way, that's exactly what me and Leo are like. So, Leo, Evan, what is your uh, plan of attack? I was going to try to shoot it. You have something to shoot it with. I did at one point in time, but I might have given it to someone. Nope, I still have a light crossbow. <laughs> Alright, you may attempt to shoot the rock. Phew. I don't actually have disadvantage on that you one. May, you, may, you, you may roll damage. You. All right, so the rock is hit with a crossbow in its in its like in its neck area, and now it is charging directly at both of you. I, I dropped the crossbow. <laughs> yeah, it is head. still <laughs> it is still charging. Oh, that's not the reason. I just, if it's gonna fight on the ground, I wanna use my. Okay, well, before Leo starts jumping right up in there, I am going to cast Shatter. At it? At it. Well, not at me. No, not it. No, but before Leo <laughs> know, gets I'm all just... up in there. <laughs> Alright, cast your Shatter. At second level. You know what? This is a rock. I'm going at third. <laughs> yeah, it's a fucking rock. Yeah, that's Sonic right. Boom. Alright, you hit the, the rock and the cave within, and a couple of rocks fall uh, fall down on it, but it doesn't seem to do any damage to the rock. The rock charges all of you, or two of you, and, uh, let me, uh, let me, let me go get its, uh, get its character sheet. Uh, who's in the, f who's the first, are you, did you step out into, like... Yes, I will take it? my me melee position. Alright, so, it charges at you and tries to strike out at you with its beak. Uh, public. Does a 23 hit you? Yes, it does. Alright, it does 24 damage to you. Ouch. As, as it strikes across the, the uh, your shoulder area. And then it attempts to grab you with one of its talons. I 
I'm assuming a 29 hits you. Yes, it does. And it does 31 damage Yay. to you. What the hell is wrong with us? You... And you are now grappled. Yeah, go hunting. Go catch restrained. a deer or something. Nah, we're gonna fight a rock. We did not choose <laughs> to fight You the followed rock. the giant bird. We followed a feather. Chris didn't say it was a massive feather. He did say it was a big feather. I did say it was a pretty big feather. Pretty big feathers. But... Uh. All right, is it my turn? <laughs> it is. It is. It is now you guys' turn. We don't need to roll initiative because there's only three of us. Uh, uh, okay. Um, you go first. Uh, wait, can I do something? I mean, um, I would assume that 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 you would be next because uh Leo tried Leo to shoot it with first. a yeah all right so i'm going to grab my sword and also just proceed to use my Wait, 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 wait. Let Evan do his thing, because you shot it. I thought I was going first. But Evan should go first. Takes here, okay. here, I'll make this easier for us. I will use initiative. Unfortunate, but necessary. Hey, Rock, get up on the map. I suppose I should get up on the map, too. <laughs> There I am. That's a very big bird. Mm-hmm. Well, very deadly Evan, bird. that's such a big feather. Why did you chase it? <laughs> you know what? You know what? All of you can just eat my ass, okay? Evan, what are you do? All right, that's it. Taking two shots. All right. Boom. Boom. And I have a question. Is it currently flying? Yes, it is. Okay. So because it because it because it was trying to come out of the cave All in right. flight. Both those shots hit, I believe, right? Uh yes. Okay. There we go. Alright, cool bonus action, you know, because it's, you know, everyone else being a jerk and not Leo, I'm going to cast Healing Word at Leo. Thank you. You're welcome. I tried. <laughs> Failed I, miserably. I, I always forget you have healing spells. Always. You always forget I'm a cleric. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, you can get healing spells from both ranger and cleric. But yes, I always forget that you can heal. Yeah, healing word you can't get from Ranger, though, unfortunately. Yeah, be good. Uh, uh, your wounds. Yeah. Rock's turn. Uh, Rock is actually not going to do a whole lot other than uh, just take flight and try to get away. Oh, gods. So it comes out of the cave. And is now, let's see, a uh, hundred and fifty feet up in the air. Carrying Leo. Yep. Failed step one. <sighs> What do you do? Uh, 
Hmm. Well. Let's look over my options. Mm-hmm. Disadvantage. Disadvantage and fall to my death if I succeed. Mm-hmm. Disadvantage. Mm-hmm. Stupid. I'm gonna go with stupid. I, I had another stupid idea of yours. Now I'm read then flame then the fucking thing can't see because it's darkness around. Yep. All right. And I'd like the second wind. Go for it. All right. Let me see if let me see if bird is stupid. Oh, that was a pretty good, it's pretty good roll. Pretty good heels. Let's see if bird is dumb. Okay. Okay. All right, bird. All right. So, Leo, here's the thing. All right, it's a good thing you um decided to uh, heal up. Cause it is, it, it is, it is not understand what is happening in its talons, and so it just kind of drops you. Oh my God, Chris! It is the way that birds hunt. Take their prey It'll up as fine. high as they can, then they drop it. Fifteen D six. So yeah, I'm gonna need you to roll fifteen D six. Oh, that's fine. Oh, uh, he's he's fine. So so the big the big part of it is like it, it you went up the it pretty much went up the like the hillside. And and when it dropped you, it dropped you at an angle to for you to land. Uh, relatively fine coming down from the side, but like then you start hitting every tree rolling down the the hillside. You guys ever seen those uh those uh when it, when you it roll down every tree and it roll down roll down a mountain and they're trying to stop but they can't. And they just hit tree after tree after tree after tree. Yeah. And combat is over because the rock is leaving. It's like, fuck that. How far is it? It's about 150 feet up. Hmm. So you can shoot at it if you'd like. Take a couple more pot shots. Yeah, I can. Would you like to take a couple more pot shots at it? Yeah, I would. All right, structure. make 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 some pot shots. So that would be a fourteen. Miss. Yeah. Okay. That's a hit, though. So ten, twenty-one, twenty-five. Plus negative five. Yeah. No, no, no. It's the global attack modifiers acting weird with it. Ah, okay. I mean, it it's not acting weird. It's doing exactly what it's supposed yeah. to. But yeah. And now the rock is gone. After it did take the hits and cause at you, but it is it is now leaving. Okay. Evan, is it still is it still within 600 feet? Yeah. Doing oh. Job. Yeah. Okay, no. Not that one. But that one. <laughs> That'll hit. It is flying away from the arrows. It does not like arrows. You let me know when it's out of the 600 feet. <laughs> it is It is now because Dash it only could. It. Yeah, it, it, it only needed two turns. Okay. I go over and check on Leo. As I was, as I was about a hundred like, getting... feet away from you, but you can you find him pretty easily. He's banged can, up a bit. Yeah, I, can, I can dash as a bonus action. I forgot I can do that now. Ha 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 ha! Chase the bird. No, I could. No, 
it moves 240 feet around. Yeah, no. No, I'm getting up to Leo, though. <sighs> you okay? Yeah. Why? What, what the hell is that? <laughs> I don't know. Shadow of Moyle is what I'm talking about. Yeah, he doesn't fucking know. What? You don't know? You can just do that and you don't know? I guess. It's... Oh, okay, well... <sighs> that was a bust. Yeah. I... What about deer? Or... I, yeah, let's try and find something on the ground. All right! <sighs> Roll another survival check! All right, now you, that you're actively looking for... You have decided to actively look for deer. You do find plenty. Okay. There is a there is a nice little herd of them. Okay. Yeah, there's a rock out there, guys. You want to go? You want to go fight it? Huh? Kind of, yes. I don't know. They did so great. I kind of want to see them finish <laughs> it off on their own. <laughs> we did it. Yeah, I kind of got. I kind of do want to go and fight it later. I'm not letting this thing win. Now my pride is at stake. But we find deer. We hunt deer. We go mm -hmm. back with deer. And yeah. Uh, Next up, I believe, and lastly, is Primrose, who has walked with Shadow Walker. Uh, I'll be right back, guys. I need to go to the restroom. Yep. Primrose! Mm -hmm. You are in a large uh, uh, dining hall with Shadow Walker, who is pulling out various... Uh, in, it, it, she, you're more in the kitchen area. Mm -hmm. It's pretty big. Uh, it's got pots and pans. Think of the uh, uh, kind of a uh, the 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 what is it called? The, you know, it's called a kitchen, but like you know the ones from I don't know Hell's Kitchen or uh, 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 various stores where you can see or not stores, but restaurants where you can see the chefs actually cooking. Um. Yeah, it's a similar thing. And uh, he's pulling out all sorts of spices and additives and herbs. And he looks over at you and asks, So, you are the Death Speaker. Raises an eyebrow. Does that not pose a... Does that not cause concern? Whatever titles people want to give me, they can give me. It doesn't mean it's who I am. I suppose not. But... I don't know. I don't have the perspective of an outsider. This has been my life. And... Everyone who has come in contact with us has... Judged us harshly. Simply because we follow the Raven Queen, we are deemed evil. Fry kind of twitches at the name. Ah! I see you do not approve. Why is this?
There was a lot of information that was withheld from us due to her secrecy, which costed us and your sister a lot. Not very... Such is... Such is the ways of the Raven Queen. She has always been a... monster when it came to deceiving others. She did try to usurp the domain of death. At least that was what I was taught. But I think you will find her a bit more Maybe not uh, optimistic or she is self-serving, but she's self-serving to a point. She uses us quite well, I think. But that is for you to judge. Why the fuck am I sneezing so much? Are you cold? No. Okay. Hold on. So where, what will you do with us once you leave us? Will you have us attend to this war that is happening outside of our forest? To be completely honest, I have no idea what I'm doing. At first he frowns, and then... Slow smile. I guess not many leaders... ...know exactly what to do when it needs to be done. That's not... That's not unheard of. So then, advice. Be willing to pass. Be willing to stop those that stand in your way when the time comes. There, the High Elves have a very strong sense of politics and policy. They'll want to manipulate you into a better deal. That is why we of the Shatterkai do not explicitly work with them. Well, considering that one of the sins is in the very center of their political circle, I don't plan on bargaining with them. Not until we get rid of the sin. And when you do, they, their games will begin again. The Eladrin love it. Our people, on the other hand, are... Not very fond of it. Anyways. Well, hopefully you don't catch me on a bad mood, because there's far other things in this world that I'd rather be doing right now. Such as? Taking my home back. Your home? The place where I grew up has been taken over by, I guess one of the sins, church, turning my siblings into child slaves 
of child soldiers fighting in a coliseum. And that is both vile and disgusting. Yes, but we have to come here first. Well, I apologize that I am... And that my sister is withholding you from completing your objective. No. We had to come here first. Try to get more allies than just our group. To And hopefully. Well, know that the Shadow Walker shadows you. And he looks to the things that he's pulled out. Is everything... Does Do you need anything else? Well, besides the main course, of, of course. No. Then I shall be about my sister. I've been helping her over the last couple of days. And he leaves. Well, um, I suppose everyone reconvenes a little bit. Oh, r uh, Blue, I'm going to come back to you. Uh, you went over to see mm -hmm. Blue and Verona, right? Or not, yes, Rose and Verona. I'm sorry, Rose right. and Verona, because you went back to the, the same place that you guys... Uh, uh, yeah, she wasn't going to talk to them, though. She was just going to lay down right. in one of the beds. Um, dramatic. Sorry, what did you say? Dramatic. I probably would have gone there, too. Uh, okay. Afterwards, yeah. a few minutes later. Mm -hmm. uh, so, Blue, when you come inside, you see Rose sitting in the chair, uh, looking over Verona, who's soundly asleep. And uh, and by soundly, I mean she's making a lot of sound. She's snoring. That's fine. I'm probably... Don't you dare do it. <laughs> Uh, probably don't you dare do it. I'm not going to say. You already know. Uh, <laughs> she, she, I assume she's used to sleeping with loud noises like that. Uh, so she is, don't, don't, don't. Uh. So she's probably just going to head over to her bed and she like flops face down into it. And she doesn't get up. That's it. That's all she does. She's like whispering to herself, but it's probably way too quiet for anyone to hear. Are you all right, Blue? Uh... She lifts her head up. Uh, I'd be a lot better if you could take your shirt off. He sighs. I did not realize that I was sorely missed. Of course you were. Like, everyone missed you. Again, I did not realize. I had assumed that while my death may have brought sadness, to leave Verona in such a state. I, I mean... Not saying it's your fault, but it did leave a lot of people in the state. And of course we'd miss you. I missed you. I'm 
That makes me feel much better than I had thought it would. <sighs> I'm going to need to get to work very soon. If Can you take your shirt off for it. <laughs> Damn it, Blue. <laughs> He kind of looks over at you, sighs, and says, Would you like to come to the forge with me? The forge? Yes. Are you going to take your shirt off in there? Because, yeah. Yes, I will take off my shirt. All right, yep, she's that's out of bed. That's a terrible idea. <laughs> she's terrible out of the bed. Idea. Don't take your shirt off in the forge. You're gonna fucking die. You didn't have You're gonna shirt get off real scarred up. I mean, it's like the sparks, the heat. The... That's hot, though. She, she, she immediately bolted out of bed. Yep, let's go. And this is about the time, Saris, you'd, you'd be able to open the door. As they're like getting up to leave. No, he, they're not up. He's not up yet. He's looking, still looking down at Verona. Okay. How, how is she? No change, but she's sleeping, and that's that's just good. She's, if when she is worried or troubled, she is awake. So sleeping is a good state for her to be in. You? Oh, um, I'm, I'm fine. Just sure what to do now. Well, I intend to reforge my equipment. Along with a few other things for you all to go with. I am going to need Leo's help, however. Hi, uh, he's out hunting. When, I, when he gets back, I'm sure he'd be happy to help you. Yep, the more the merrier. Blue, I will ret I will come for you whenever whenever I have uh, procured the proper tools. You looked tired when you came in. Oh, we're not doing it now. Doing what? Just give me a few minutes. Ah, oh, she's gonna go lay back down in bed, face first again. I will return. And he stands to leave. All right. Anybody else doing anything other than or need or want to do anything or say anything to anyone before the dinner is prepared? Um, Just so I am. From... am I working with Rose before dinner is prepared? Uh, I don't know, but he will, uh, it, it, when you get back, he will come to you and ask if you could, if you would help him. Yes, but I'm gonna go ask for him first if she can de-exhaust me, as I am currently beaten to shit and exhausted. Uh, do I have that? Oh, it's, yeah, T, yeah. I was like, do I have that spell ready? Yeah. Is your mic on? Oh, it was up because I. Yeah. Okay. Anyway. My oh. mic says blue on it. What? The mic says blue on it. Yeah, it's a blue Yeti. 
<laughs> Good <Yep>. God. <laughs> well, there's the title. My mic says blue My on mic it. My mic says blue on it. <laughs> yes, it's a blue Yeti. I'm sorry. I never noticed. <laughs> My mic. Your mic. What if do you I mean, didn't... your mic? have my glasses on, you would have heard me facepalm. Oh. The reaction was there. Listen, I was excited for a second, even though I was like, I have no idea why it says my character's name on it, but it does! Mm -mm. I wonder, it's almost like you named your fucking character after a primary color! Yeah. Ah, <laughs> uh, no. I think we've established the primary color was named after her. Uh, right, of course. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> right, right. Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll make, I'll make two. <laughs> Fuck. You guys are dumb. <laughs> well, no, you. I am not dumb. Evan is. No, it's both. I oh, didn't. Okay. I I didn't stutter. Nice. <sighs> hey, I don't pick favorites around here. All right. So, uh, uh sorry, there's uh, also something I wanted to do in the. Oh, go for it. Leo wants to try to make a magical weapon. Oh. Out of metal. Uh huh. Sorry. Wow. <laughs> Did we all just like drink dumb bitch juice recently? <laughs> no, I said exactly what I meant. What's in your water, guys? I haven't said anything stupid Cancer, yet. Cancer, probably. <laughs> Just Not straight wrong. up cancer cells. Um. Okay. You want to make a magic weapon out of just straight up metal. You want to do it like. Hammer. You, you want to do it the way Rose does. Congratulations. You've made a copper long sword. <laughs> um, is that what you're trying. Is that what you're wanting to do? Do it the way Rose does, essentially. Essentially, what he's trying to do is he's trying to make a normal weapon. But he wants to see if anything is different about him so he can make it magic. Ah. Now that he's died. Ah. Got it. Mm. Got it, got it, got it. I understand. You're trying to you're trying to do some kind of uh uh magical because you could only make a normal equipment. You want to see if you could do He used to be a really good mundane blacksmith. Now yeah. he wants to see if he can he's, if he can be an average magical <laughs> All right, so uh, we'll get to that shortly. Uh, anybody else? Hey, Sarah, do you think they have booze? Um, I could go and look for some for you. That sounds amazing. It's been like five years since I've gotten wasted. <sighs> Of course. Let's see what I can get you. But you're not gonna get too drunk, okay? Oh, I see. Yeah, sure. And she, like, winks. <laughs> uh huh. I will go and look for alcohol after, you know, like, making all sure right. everyone is all okay. The Shatterkai have have multiple wines and hearty ales because they are because they are because they like they're like the punk rock of drinkers, you know. Like what punk else? Rock? Look, look, look. Let, let me let me let me explain my my thought process. Okay, so what elves, right? They're the surfer dudes. <laughs> so what else, right? <laughs> They're the surfer dudes, They're the right? Stoners, yes. They, 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 they drink. They would normally drink like some heavy stuff, but it would be hallucinogenic, you know. 
Or, or they're the super them. vegan ones who drink, like, actual juiced grass. Um, uh, high elves, they're the wine drinkers. Uh, I'll call out of grass. It should be bad. Uh, Aladrin elves, they would, they, they, they would make edibles. And they feed them to you and be and trick you because they're assholes. Oh yeah, it's a normal yes, they, cookie. Yes, they are the ones who roofie everything. Uh, and then the sea elves don't drink anything because it's liquid. They're constantly drinking that shit. Nah, they do seaweed. Mm. <laughs> Hell yeah. Uh, but but it's spelled like blood yes. of sea weed. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, the, the I want to say the 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 Shatter Kai they they're the hard alcohol people, but they do, but there's no hard alcohol like around. They don't have the proper um. Life. Uh, supplies None of them are to me. Drunks to make moonshine. Yeah. They're not dumbasses. Okay. Well, I'll try to get something strong. For... That's the and wrong. all of this stuff that's made still is only half as strong as the doors can make. Oh, oh my brother's calling me. Hold on. Yeah. If, he's, if he's yelling about Pokemon, you have to put him on. No, he's probably calling to ask about food and shit. Ah, oh, shit, it's too late to order pizza. He was being a good boy and offering to buy me food on his way home. Oh, that's nice. He's, all, he, he's, he's a good lad. He just He just happens to also be a little brother, so... You know, okay. Pokemon, yeah. <laughs> so, but yeah, um, yeah, you get you get some reasonably strong alcohol. It's not the it's not any anything to write home to. The, uh, Jariana drinks drinks harder on a daily basis, but okay. All right, I mean, I'll, uh, I'll pay for it. I'm not gonna just like raid them for alcohol. Uh. All right, twenty gold. Oh, okay. Wait, you just accept it? Okay, he 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 stops and he's like, "No, it's two. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to fuck with you like that." <laughs> wow. He backed right. off real quick. <laughs> How much could a banana be? Like fifty dollars? <laughs> if it's strapped to a wall, then a lot fucking more. Like, yeah, you know how many chickens it is? Um, no. <laughs> Wait, did no, did no one get that reference? I no. did. I okay. did. Arrested yeah. Development. Okay. I don't. I don't no. watch. I don't watch Arrested Development. No, that, that's the, not what it was from. It's from real life. Yeah, they sold that. Mm -hmm. And then, I, some, I don't know and then the... someone ate it <laughs> and got arrested. And then someone else wrote something on the wall where it was, and they got arrested. I don't know what we're talking about, but okay. Uh, we're Hold talking on. about uh, actual art community. Hold on. Yes. Let me get I started. still love the one uh, cleaning lady that like swept up an exhibit and threw it out because it looked like trash. Yep. Yep. <laughs> I heard about sure. that one. Yeah. She didn't get in trouble, which is good on her. Um, but yeah. So you've got the alcohols now. All right. Uh. I will bring it on over to Blue. Uh, she's just still face down in her bed. Uh, yeah, no one's shirtless, so why bother to get up? <laughs> All right. uh, Is there anything else that I can get you? Uh, she sits up and like just starts downing one of the bottles. Uh she stops for a second. At her. Uh, 
And she kind of thinks for a moment and she's like, do you think it's true? Which part? Like any of what she said? Some of it probably is. But I don't think that it would have so much as a bearing on your yourself as she seems to think it would. I mean, I guess they were hot enough for me to come from, but like, still, none of the aesthetic was there. She just keeps chugging. Uh, um, well, uh, well, my grandmother was CMAT, so I suppose it doesn't really mean a whole lot aesthetic wise. I mean, Except it does, because you have fucking scales on your neck. Yeah, but I don't have five heads. But you could. <laughs> but I could. Uh, right, I'm sorry. So. Uh, she's like, yeah, I mean, yeah. I don't know. I'm out of all the wild and crazy stories I came up with for where I came from and, you know, who my parents were, uh, coming from literal sin wasn't one of them, or coming from a dragon that I thought I created uh, didn't make the top three? No. Are you worried at all? If we have to go up against pride? Only in so much that he might try to hurt you. Specifically. Oh, you're worried about me. That's so sweet. Of course I would be. All right, really? I'm over it, and she's going to grab a bottle and just keep chugging, and she's like, is there anything we need to do? Well, uh, just get ready for dinner. Uh, don't get too drunk before then. That's all. But if there's anything you need, I'm here. As I always. know. Thanks. And, uh, She's gonna drink a little more. She's like, man, did you water this down? No, I didn't. I don't seem to be heavy drinkers here. That's a shame. When we get into a town, I want you to promise me we're gonna go to a bar. We will. Definitely. Nice. I promise I won't put you in Evan's bed again. Although I didn't exactly do that. Uh, yeah. All right. Uh, Prim, mm. you got slabs of meat thrown in front of you. Mm -hmm. This is deer. You gonna dress it? What would Amon would it would would Amon have taught? How to uh, is 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 Amon a big meat eater? Um, I would imagine so because I feel like the temp or the Church of Hestia would cook whatever was given to them. Mm. All right, cool, perfect. Then uh, I need you to roll me either survival or just a straight wisdom check. Uh, Evan will assist with the dressing. Fuck. Is that All right. a fucking three? It is. Uh, it's thir 13 because Evan was assisting. Oh, so four. Evan Great. Evan hunted for sport because sport. Um, so. Sport. Yeah. Here's the weird part. 
Uh, you've never actually taken apart the, the food. You no. usually bought it in the market already ready butchered. to go. Butchered and everything. It, it, it was salted and preserved. Wrapped up, to, ready to go to be purchased. Mm -hmm. So, not the, not your cleanest work, but you were still able to do it. You didn't fail, you just not... It just not, what didn't succeed to the highest amount. Mm -hmm. And, and uh, you start... What, what, what kind of food would you make out of the deer? Uh, what do humans eat? Stew is yeah, usually fucking, a pretty safe bet. That's what I was thinking. Yeah, I'm like, what stew would be a good one? Would they fucking make stew here? Because she asked for a specific just... dish that they don't have here. I don't know what the fuck well, they ate. Considering Amon, Amon definitely would have taught you how to make a stew if there were so many kids, because it can feed a large group. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> yeah, fuck it. She's getting stew. I don't care. It's venison stew. That's not something she's had. Yeah, she said she hasn't really eaten any meat. Alright. So, I'm going to need another one. And this one is for this one is for the actual creation of your Stew, and you have advantage on this one because you do have check? some. Well, uh, it it would be a cooking utensils, but I don't know if you have that. Oh. Yeah. So you have advantage on the survival check, but it the 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 success the the DC is going to be higher. So you don't have cooking utensils, unfortunately. I mean, a kitchen, a though. Yes, I, I mean, I mean, like you don't have the proficiency. No, it didn't come with the class. It did not. That's not bad. That's pretty good, honestly. That's better than uh, most days for you. As you re recall your cooking with Amon, you remember her talking about the certain things that come with making stew, and oh, thank you. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Was there a liquid? Cool. Did you just ask if you had a drink by asking, was there a liquid? Yes. <clears throat> oh, you say, uh, is, is there something wrong with that? You could have just asked, is there a drink? Drink. <laughs> is there a liquid? Is really a serial killer. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Alright. I'm sorry, do you guys not say liquid? No. I ask well, if there's a drink like a normal fucking person. Well, you guys are weird. Were you given a liquid? Yes, I was given a liquid. That's good. Oh yeah, you you recall her teachings when it came to making the the uh, food itself. Uh, remember all the different kinds of herbs and and with your knowledge of. Um, uh, uh, of your own, of your own herbalism and everything, you know the particular combination of of plants that will produce a good tasting food, and uh, you begin boiling up the stew, and Evan, you're helping her. Whenever she says, whenever she says, hand me this, that, and the third, you just hand it off. And uh, whenever she calls it, uh, calls a plant by its proper name, you you just stare at her like, the fuck? what is that? Is that the 
leafy one, or is that <laughs> the leaf? is that the orange one? <laughs> Do you add anything special to it? Love. No. I don't know. That, that that's that's a that's a Friendship. hard thing to go with it. <laughs> Using yeah, kind of a mood, so probably not. Uh, okay. To the love part, not the extra stuff. Do they have I, like anything I was weird? joking. <laughs> anything in particular that you add to it, or no? Is there anything weird in the kitchen? I mean, you that do have, have your. Uh, not necessarily. It's mostly normal plants that you would see. But you do have your teas. Oh, there's one that if you eat it, it does shit. Hold on. That's a bad fact. Oops, nope. That's addictive. Nope. Just kidding. None of them? Uh, there's only two that have eaten effects, so... Okay. And you prepare a proper stew. Leo! You see Rose inquiring about the forge and being brought to it with several tools. Okay. What do you do? I I go and forge. He sees you, greets you. Ah, Leo, the perfect man for the job. I need some assistance creating more magical, or not magical, but cre creating equipment for myself. Yeah, standard plate and all. Nods. Uh, one second. I need to go fetch Blue. She said she wanted to watch me work. Uh, we're just going to hit metal. She enjoys watching me hit metal. I think she enjoys watching everyone hit metal. But. He just shrugs. If that's how she wants to spend her afternoon. He leaves in blue after a short time. He comes back through the door, looks over at Verona. Any change? He says to you. Uh, no. Everything's well. Well, me and Leo are going to go at the forge, if you would like to. Yep, she's already gone. She's already, she's right next to him at the door. Let's go. Enjoy yourself. Oh. And, oh, go ahead. Oh, sorry. I was going to say she's going to give Sarah's like a wave as she leaves. She's like, I will. Leo said he wanted to help, or and I did ask for it. Oh, don't worry. The more, the merrier. Very well. And they go to the forge. Leo, I need you to roll me a blacksmithing <clears throat> check, a smithing tools check. Uh, what attributes? Well, it depends. What are you wanting to make? 
I would like to make a magical longsword, and I would like to make a normal set of plate armor. Okay, so first things first, let's talk about your um your plate armor. Again, it happens very quickly because you are using the um you are using the uh, the uh, the hammer that Rose provided Can you. I literally make it in the amount of time it takes him to go get blue. Yeah, you could. I do that. <laughs> Damn, son. And, uh, it, it's magic. I mean, pound against the ingot, and the ingot just easily shapes into the way that you want it to. You'd probably be, like, 80% of the way finished. Mm -hmm. Well, the last 20% should be done after we've mm -hmm. made sure it's measurements anyway. Yeah, and, uh, he opens the door, sees you. Wow. I did not know you were... Wow. Interesting. Will this suffice? Thickness you like and such. Yes. Uh, thank you. No problem. Is there something I could help you with? I was going to spend the day making that, but now uh, I suppose I'm not. No, the only no. other thing I would... What? what? <laughs> she's, like, she's like, come on! <laughs> oh, actually, Blue, you could help. Could you take his measurements so I could finish? Yes! Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Leo just smiles at Rose. Stands up, kind of holds his arms out. I don't know. The clothing might get in the way. <sighs> starts, I start stripping, but not like d down to his down to the to the undergarments. I get your joke, but also it probably won't because you do want to wear clothes under armor. You do know that. Right? <laughs> oh, okay. Sorry. And he pounds the metal again. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, she'll take his measurements. Leo, roll an insight for me. All right. It's kind of silly that Rose would do this because he's supposed to know that too. Yeah, I mean... Yeah, Leo has... Leo thought. And goes back to work. Uh, Blue takes a long time getting the measurements. You gotta get them perfect. Mm -hmm. Rose is stoic through the whole thing. Well, roll an insight, Blue. Oh, yes. I'm so good at that. Give me a second. Haha. I yeah, did Rose is, Leo. Rose is stoic through the whole thing. Alright. And then uh after you finish the measurements, he hands them off back to back to Leo. Leo finishes work and finishes going at the plate. Uh he asks the both of you to help him put on his armor so it takes shorter time yep and feels good maybe a bit thinner but that might be because it was you had less metal to work with because elf yeah but it's just as protective as most And then he looks at you and says, so how can I help you with your 
whatever thing you're going to do. As he notices you haven't put away the tools yet. I would like to do the rest myself. Thank you, though. Are you sure? He just nods. Very well. Aww. Well then, we shall be out of your way. Blue? Yeah, Blue can help you take the armor back off. Yes, I can. She gives Leo, like, a wink. Alright, so, magic sword time. Yes. What? Your intention is just to make a make up just a mechanically a plus one sword. Essentially, yeah. Did I lose Chris or did I get lost? No. no. Oh, okay. That's just in fucking I don't know shit. why I don't know why I cut out. Yeah, I don't either. That was weird. Like that. Um So what was the last thing you heard from me? Mechanically a plus one sword. Okay. So I need three blacksmithing <laughs> Uh Blue, this would be the the, the, the opportunity time to do Spartac inspiration, I'm just saying. I thought I left. You're taking the armor off of. Oh, okay. You can give me bardic inspiration so that, because I wingman so well. Yeah, uh, I wolf whistle as you're doing it and give you bardic inspiration. Ideal. <laughs> Ideal. Okay, three checks. Mm-hmm. What attribute? Uh. We're going to go one dex, one strength, and one con. Oh. Oh, dear. I will put uh, the bardic on that one, I guess. Okay. You know, my nat one. What is the die? A D10, I believe. Yeah. All right. All right. <laughs> Down the line, that strength dex con, right? Yes, sir. All right. So, uh,. The ingot in your hand. So here's here's the uh, here's the rub that you've always had. You just hadn't felt this kind of energy behind uh, your swings. You know that you see, whenever you saw Rose swing, you saw the hammer light up with some kind of awesome power. And as he swung down, the, the the blade was just forged out of the ingot. And uh, he hammered again and again and again into it. And for you, it's it was always just hit it, hit it until it hit it until it becomes what I want. But ever since you've picked up that sword and casted the casted your spell, as it were, you felt when you did it, you felt this kind of um connection being formed with some nebulous force. And you attempt to push in the same way, and you see the hammer light up just as Rose's did through all your 
apprenticing. And, uh, yeah, you're, you brute, you pretty much brute force the ingot into shape. Now, when it comes to the finer details, uh, you were, you never were good at making rapiers or, or, uh, daggers or, you know, anything with neat that needed fine tuning you were good at making bludgeoning or big weapons but real people weapons yeah real people as 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 those in asgol would say an actual weapon but throughout it all you still have the focus that rose had that had taught you to put into your work. And you're able to not make the best long sword in all of existence. I mean, Rose would look at it and say, throw it out. But it's still reasonable. But you don't feel tired at all at the end of it. You feel drained, but you don't feel tired. You place the sword into the uh, cooling pit of water, and you see this elegant blade of your make. And you indeed have made a plus one longsword. All right. It I get ready you, for dinner. It, it took you a couple hours, so... Well, let's say an hour to make. You what with Rose's Amber. Of swords. Uh, Blue. Yeah. Since it took so long, Rose asked you to come with him. Because uh, he wants to t try out the uh, armor while walking. Oh, definitely. And uh, date the forge got cut short. And uh, he thinks for a long moment and says, "You know." I have not heard one of your stories in quite some time. Oh. Would you like to? If you do not mind. Anything for a pretty face. And, uh... I have to actually look at her stories again, goddamn. It's been so long. Uh, she'll do uh, the Dawnbrenner one. That one. And I'm gonna let's roll performance on that. And I'm gonna use Verona's thing, so that's a plus five to that. Alright, good, good, good. One second, please. Okay. <clears throat> go, um, consult a character sheet real quick. I need to move somebody back to their proper place. Oh, uh, shadow fell. There we go. You get back in there. Okay. I moved Rose to 
to his to back into the Kel family. Yay. And uh I need to roll a thing for him. Uh you don't get this anymore, Alex, sorry. Yeah, that's okay. Need to roll a thing for him. Okay, so as you do, you do you do you ever do the 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 words in the same way? Uh, like the stories are exactly the same. No, uh, she doesn't write them down or memorize them. She just has them. They're they're only kind of memorized. Okay, so. Is there like are there phrases that uh that are probably the same? Yeah, it's like when you tell someone a story that happened to you, it's probably not going to be the same every time, but there's mm-hmm. like parts and things that you say that are the same. Okay, so for those moments I need you to roll an insight. Okay. Is that just one then? Oh, actually, it'd be perception, probably. Okay. Yeah, perception. Yeah, it'd be just the one. So every time you get to those parts, mm-hmm. he he's mouthing while you're saying the same words. Okay. Like, he has them memorized, essentially. Okay. Uh, when she's done playing, she kind of looks at him in surprise. And she's like, do you... You remember the song? Why wouldn't I? Hello. What he, he, did I did I not say it? Why wouldn't I? Yeah, I heard you. Um, I didn't hear anything. I was like waiting for a response. Uh, what did you say? Why wouldn't Why wouldn't I? Know the words. Uh, just most people don't. Uh are you a fan? Blue, you nearly you tell your stories every single time I come to see you. Oh my or gosh, I have a fanboy. <laughs> she looks super excited. <laughs> <sighs> yes, I am what you would call a fan. Oh my gosh, I have a fanboy. <laughs> she she's like laughing and she's she's definitely like teasing him a bit. And he's Which doing the sl- he's he's doing the slow like eye rub or eyebrow rub like oh god. Which one's your favorite? Come on. Um, so this might be a bit odd, but I enjoy the ship one. Oh, really? I do like that one. I have I thought you... always wished to sail upon the sea. I mean, you're a prince, why don't you? I am not a prince. I am the captain of the guard. Okay, you're the captain of the guard, why don't you? Got him. The 
captain of the guard doesn't leave his charge. Yeah, but it, it's got captain in the name. <laughs> got him. I, 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 I don't know how to respond to this. <laughs> what, you don't take vacation days? That's a thing, uh, right? I have never taken a vacation day. Ah, boo. Listen, I'm going to steal you. We're going to go on a boat. I suppose you that that would be acceptable but you have to go swimming have, though that would be the point of going to the ocean yes well yes i just want to make sure that it was clear i don't think they're called sick days I am, Fine, diagnosed with, I am diagnosed with dead. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, that's um, true. He's not the captain of the guard anymore because he was fucking dead. He's a jobless boy. Yeah, he doesn't have no job no more. Are we sure that if Verona decides to sleep for the rest of this year, he's not just going to take the throne while Saris isn't sitting Jariana on it. Jariana has the throne. Oh, that's right. Jariana has it. <sighs> she no doesn't. More application. She also doesn't want it. Jariana. <sighs> I mean, no one wants it. Literally, it's just Saris. Saris <laughs> was trained for I don't know if she Saris still wants it. I was told that I shouldn't have it. You were told that you should you should strive for something better. She believes that. So. so nobody wants it. I'll take it. No. <laughs> God, and no one would know what the actual policies were they it just changed on the day day to day yeah. basis oh yeah, yeah. On but the, job. But, the, but, only but, the only consistent one nobody has shirts on in my presence exactly what about the women nobody has shirts on in it's my topless. presence yeah, everyone topless all the time <laughs> anyways uh so blue yep uh, after a short while, he leads you back to the village, and the dining begins. And we will we will stop session here, and we will pick up right with the dining hall uh, uh, activities. Woo! Oh my God, he's going to make us fight in the dining hall again. Please don't. I have forty health. <laughs> You guys are the ones that were like, hmm. That's a that's a big ass bird. I'ma shoot it. That was on you guys. <laughs> I had no you guys could have just looked at that bird and been like, you know what? No. I'm out of here. See, you say that, but I also rolled an 8 on my stealth, so I don't know if I actually you had You initiated the combat, Chris. You could have no, let I that didn't. Bird keep sleeping. No, I didn't. I did not initiate the combat. That bird could have kept sleeping. <laughs> that we I... did attack first. The, the bird woke up. I know, but you did attack first. Yeah, the bird woke up. <laughs> <laughs> Could you imagine w trying to sneak past somebody and 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 they wake up and they just start screaming? Oh my God! There's someone here! And you shoot them in the face. <laughs> that is proper hunting procedure. It woke up. Shoot it. <laughs> Ideally, you'd be shooting it before it wakes up. That's proper hunting procedure. When in doubt, try 
we close this Yugi. It looked at you guys, caught, and you just shot it. And even it was... <laughs> the only reason Evan started blasting was, was like, why'd you shoot it? <laughs> Did you tell me not to shoot it? You well, shot it before he said anything. I mean, I mean, I will say, I will say this. Evan, Evan was pretty much like, "Hey, Leo, maybe you shouldn't put, poke your head." <laughs> Leo, pull your head back. <laughs> Look, in Asgol, the bigger the hunt, the better. He he's not wrong though. No, but we're. Not in Asgall. But but people also right. aren't Asgall's dumb. Fucking gone. I, I, people also aren't as dumb as a f bunch of rocks and have, you know, have some sense to to not shoot the giant bullet, or in this case, rock. I need to throw more bullets in my in my campaigns. Please no. Like the gun? No, like bullets. Like like the creature. Remember the sand creature? No. When Remember the sand were... creature from the first campaign the very, that, that very, tried very to eat first us? The campaign that came oh, up to yeah. the floor in the. Yeah. The we had a sand shark. Yes. Because it crit me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he didn't like that you had the tiny hut. So he's like, you know what? Fuck you. It's coming up in the middle while you're sleeping. Which, fair. Look at that a uh, lot. He wanted to Remember do a survival the... game with, in, in a magical D&D &D world. I don't know about Chris, but I did ask him each time I took something more survival-y. Mm -hmm. Like, before I took Create Fruit or Water, I asked him. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. no, I did ask him the about... entire time. Yeah, I'm like, hey, I am I saw I could take this spell. I wanted to ask you if it was okay. I could choose something else. And he's like, no, go ahead and take it. He he did he 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 said Goodberry was a no no, but I asked him. All right, I'm gonna take Tiny Hut. That cool? And he's like, Yeah, sure. And I'm like, All right, cool. And then he proceeded to complain about it throughout the entire campaign. Yep. And then I was like, Tiny Hut. <laughs> Everybody group hug. We don't need to group hug for the spell. Group hug. We all know where she did. Did 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 Blue pick up that habit? I mean, I wouldn't. I don't know if it's necessarily from Kalen if he does group hugs with the circus troop. I mean, uh, group hug, anyways, though. Okay, if you want it to be from that, that's totally fine. No, 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 no. I was just wondering. I was just wondering. It's fine if it if it wasn't. I did not think that far ahead of it. It was more of just Blue's like, y'all need to show some fucking emotion. Hugs. We hug now. Hugs are the great e equivalents in the world. I don't like that. It, it, hey, hey, I need you guys to do me a favor. Oh, God. Evan Primrose, what? Change your color. I don't care how that's going to change. I was pink first, bitch. <laughs> but change it. I was pink first. I don't know if that's the issue. <clears throat> Is that better? Yes. Okay. Immensely. Look, it was bothering me. <laughs> You I don't know what. How many sessions has it been? Look, all right. It's poor form to be the same color. I didn't know if it, I didn't know if it was if you guys were the same or not, so I didn't want to say anything. But I finally cracked and was like, I got, I got to I got to it, It's got to change, all right. It's just got to. Mm -hmm. Sure. I hope the session was great for you guys. I good. promise Sorry. you guys won't be fighting in the dining dining I hall. Made soup. We'll be fighting outside the dining there hall. There may be there may be combat, but you won't be fighting.
Okay. At any point during the day, did I have time for a short rest? Uh, yes. You had. Sh- you you can have you can have a short rest now. I will take a short. It, rest. it 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 doesn't take you that long to smith anything with um <clears throat> with Rose's <clears throat> hammer. Rose just doesn't like using that hammer because he thinks it's cheating. Well, not cheating, but like shortcutting. I should ask for a sword. I should I should get a magic sword. I should have asked for my armor to get upgraded. You guys don't know he can do magical shit. You're, I've already upgraded yours as much as you know he can do. Uh, Evan. Is it studded leather? That's it. Yeah, that's it. That's it. That's as much as you know he can do. Yeah, that's fair. He's all. He he hasn't he hasn't come out and said you know I can I can I can do shit again. Leave. Not only did you fuck up my virtue, you also fucked up the protections my mom put in place when I was born. But also, thank you for bringing me back from the dead. (laughs) What? She wanted to help you. Can't blame her for that. Hey, hey, we, we don't, we, you know, it's all the Raven Queen's fault. She's the one who said, nah, we're putting everything back the way it should be. And we're like, but why? You're, you're gonna, you're changing Leo. <laughs> because when he dies, she wants to be able to claim his soul. I mean, yeah. what? I have a solution <laughs> for that. <laughs> don't die. I mean, Sarah, uh-huh. Sarah's and Evan have the same solution. I, I don't know if that's true. Uh, what? Put him under a different god? Well, you can't. I know. I know I, what I'm thinking, Sarah's is thinking, is not what I'm thinking, Evan is thinking. I know what Sarah's solution is. Oh, is that. Oh, okay. Yep. Okay. That might, that might work. Well, for a while, but. <laughs> yeah, no, I mean, I mean, Evan, Evan has a decent solution. Don't like die. Just I mean, don't die. I mean, that's just... my solution. Yeah. I mean, that's fuck fair, you or die if I want to. Oh, okay. Come on, guys. My idea is pretty good. We don't know what your idea is. Yeah, you haven't said it yet. Put him under the faith of a different god, who would then have a stronger claim to his soul. I think the Raven Queen's claim would win. Let's put it that way. Just promise your soul to a whole bunch of people and watch them fight it out. (laughs) The ideal. (laughs) I mean, yeah. All right, all right, all right. So, 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 idea time. All right. One level of warlock, one level of sorcerer, and as an Osimar. Three different, three different. Three different uh, divine beings, celestial beings, and then be a paladin and a cleric, and then be a cleric of a completely different god. And so what I'm hearing is, do a terrible, terrible build that I have none of the stats. Actually, actually, it Uh, works. Sorlock is pretty good with paladin. Is still also fine. All right, all right. So, you make a life cleric, right? Level one life cleric. Then pick up the celestial warlock. Then pick up the sorcerer. Divine soul. Divine soul. Yes. Suddenly, you become a god. Yeah, you can do shit tons of healing. I don't meet the requirements for any of those things. Though. You know, it actually might work. You know, that could, instead of like it being like one, like each god fighting for it, you could basically become like a pantheon. That's it. I've got to go kill Jalen. <laughs> <laughs> that escalated quickly. Or I could no, just like, take it. Yeah, no, you could like worship an entire pantheon and it would actually work out 
like cause I can't wait. Like, I can't wait. I can't wait to show you guys the update on that uh, on their situation. Oh my god, I just remembered. I I finished the the update on their situation. Oh good. Yeah, when were we playing that again? They're all fine. End of the act. I'm gonna show you guys the update soon. Really? Soon. Soon. It's probably gonna be after uh, you fix the Elven stuff. Oh, mm. so like in three months? <laughs> we have more I sessions don't... like this. It will uh, be. Oh yeah, three, if at it's least more three. sessions like this, it's gonna be three months. Hey. At least three. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not mad. I made soup. And that's it. <laughs> I'm sorry. I thought well, today I was to... gonna be a lot different. So. I'm sorry. Wait, your 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 segment is going to be all next session. It's, I'm not mad that I didn't do anything. It's just as a whole group, there was a lot for blue. And yes, that was good. But I think a lot of session could have been used for other stuff. Okay. I don't know. It just, I'll put I it felt, into consideration. I felt the pacing today was fucking low as shit. Considering what is going on in the world. And what we have to do. I don't think that's very fair. I mean, I see what you're meaning, but Alicia really hasn't gotten a lot. And that really kind of wasn't very nice to her or... Not what I was intending it to sound like. Like, what what I was thinking is like, yes, like, that entire focus that Alicia had, and that time that Alicia had for her character, was totally fine, and not what I was complaining about. It was just like, how long it took to make the fucking soup. The session was just an afternoon, and that is... Yeah. That's it can like, feel weird sometimes. Yeah. I get it. It's yeah. like one day for three hours. It just felt but, bad. I don't know. I like I liked what happened. Because I thought it was interesting. It had some good moments. Pacing felt a little awkward, I think. That's that's the general thing. I really need to go to bed, guys. Uh, have a good night. week. I will see you all next week. Good night. Good night. Yeah, I kind of spent a lot of time meandering around, but that's okay. We spent a lot of time doing my stuff. I think it's because we kind of feel like we're on a time crunch. Yeah. With everything going on the world. I, I liked it. I fun. The indie is weird because you can take the same amount of time to do five hours that it takes to do five months in game and both can be equally important and it's kind of weird to get into the head of a character that's like yeah actually they would have gone through five months even though it took us three hours or yeah i don't know pacing is weird sure is I don't know. It's just like. I thought we were going to get like some planning on next stuff and like maybe have conversations on what Lou had and all that, but. Yeah, sorry. I was waiting for. Blue is going to tell everyone because that's just her character, mm -hmm. but uh, she... she was actually going to wait for the dinner to bring it up. Yeah. Yeah, we, we'll probably do playing during the dinner, too. Um, and you want the dinner to be in-game, not uh, texture. I mean, you guys can do... Camp we can do campfire dinner if, you'd li if you guys like. I don't mind either way. I 
crumbs if someone doesn't respond and then say something. Yeah. See, here's 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 what I'll say about it. Uh, the 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 whole planning thing and everything. The thing I was gonna do, uh, you know. I just felt like you guys have been handling super serious stuff for a little while, so I was like, hmm, maybe I should throw in some RP fun stuff. Mm -hmm. But if if we want the story to 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 progress, then I, I feel I, that's, that, like that's fine. having a bit less boom, 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 go, go, go could be beneficial for some of the characters personally but it does it yeah it's always this mix of i think it could be helpful for the characters but as players it is a bit of a weird yeah it was just like from like oh no a giant ancient blue dragon has attacked our city and then you guys are going back to your thing and it kind of like gave the impression that we are going to go back to the thing and start talking about what the fuck we are going to do next. And then it was like, oh, make soup. And then everyone split off into your own thing. And then a huge lore dump for Blue. And everyone was doing their own shit. I don't know. I, I probably would have been fine if I hadn't had the assumption of what was going to be happening. Yeah. Which I guess is kind of my fault. Like, fault is the right word for it. But mismatched expectations is a, a common problem nothing to be ashamed about i will say this you guys did kind of decide what you wanted to do already it's more ah. what what do you want i let you outside i don't know what to do guys my dog is broken <laughs> They have that glitch sometimes. Just let it reset.